Hey everybody, this is Genova Member here, and this is the second time this segment is being filmed. And we're on our way to Fireburg. So, we got to go find Ruben. Uh, I'm not going to talk to anybody if you want to go ahead, but Ruben's right here. You're Ruben, huh? Have you heard about the Crystal of Fire? I can't deal with that now. I've got to help Dad. Well, why don't you let me help you? He's stuck behind a boulder. There'd be no problem if we had a mega grenade, but only Dad's friend could use him. Where's the guy's house? In this town, but he shut himself in. We'll pay him a visit anyway. You know, I find it funny how Benjamin knew that he was Reuben, and he never met him before. But, whatever. So, now we're gonna go pay that guy a visit. And, once again, I'm not talking to anybody. So, he's down here. And there's actually a treasure here with some refreshers. Oh, heal potions. Eh. Like I said, memory's fading. <clears throat> so, it's locked. No shit. So, we gotta go find a key. Well, this old dude... No, never mind. So, we go into the hotel and we meet Tristam. What's up? We want... We went to the house in the pit, but the guy wouldn't let us in. You two want in? Then take this. Yeah, bye, Tristam. Thanks for the help. Yeah, the multi-key supposedly opens any lock. So, we're gonna go open that up. Ooh, it opened. Really? I ran when I saw the monsters in the volcano. A huge boulder fell in trapped area, and only a mega can aid can free him. How do you use one? Just throw it. That's all you have to do? Just throw it? I thought you stuffed it up your butt. You gotta love the dialogue in these old games. They treat you like you're stupid. Okay, so... Yeah, I'm not doing the battlefields on camera. I'll do those off camera because I'm not doing another battlefield filler. And we want to go to the mines next, so... We're going to start by heading up, because there's actually a treasure we want to get before we get to the boss. Okay, Reuben's Morning Star will most likely kill all the enemies in one hit. So, those are safe bets. That's a safe bet to use. Except when he's paralyzed. And we're going... Bomb through here. Oh, dumbass. Going through here. And you look at that. Look at all these enemies. Oh yeah, there's a lady in Fireburg who will sell you her battle axe. Um, I didn't get that. But, uh, I'll get that later in the video because we have to return to Fireburg anyway. Yay, we level up. Gotta love those strike firsts. Mm. Ah. Mm. Come on. Well, good news is Ruben's high level, so he'll end up attacking first, most likely. Yeah, bombs are better to use. Just don't go up using all your bombs, because you need them to free the Ruben's dad. Chests will most likely contain mega grenade bombs, so you won't have to worry about running low. So. See how much of the mine we can get through. I think I'll be able to do at least half of it this segment. And then next segment, heal potions. Next segment, I'll probably finish it up. Maybe. If I feel like it. Yeah, the battle axe is stronger than the sword. The axe upgrades stronger than the sword ones, except with the exception of Excalibur, which is the strongest weapon in the game. Yeah, we're about halfway through this video already, so... Hmm. 
Goodbye. Okay, let's heal Rune. And I bought 99 cure potions. Oh, you... Ah. Oh. Well, that's okay, that's why I brought a bunch of them. And... We want to kill these guys. We can get the treasure. Grand scheme of basically every game. Kill the enemies, gain experience, level up, kick ass. Hooray, we cleared the room. And we get cure potions this time. Come on, you piece of shit, change. Okay, next. I'm gonna go this way. And, uh, see what's down here. Yeah, nothing. Okay, don't go that way. <laughs> like I said, been a while since I played. So, we're gonna go down here. I'm sure there's nothing over here. Okay, this is a way back. So we want to kill these guys. And sometimes the claw will kill. Instant kill, sometimes it won't. Since it's random, I'm not gonna, like, waste time trying playing games with the claw, so. Since you're not... Since you're not limited to a 10 minute video. And have all the time to play, feel free to experiment. That's just rather sad. Okay. Um, then I think I should be coming up to the claw soon. Yeah, let... Yeah, you get an upgraded claw in this, um... Level. Which... Basically... Sucks, kind of. It's not better than the battle axe. You know, if you're a completionist, go for it. Just make sure you get it before you do the next area, because then you'll get the the final claw upgrade, and then you'll permanent you'll uh, not be able to use it because you'll already be using the dragon claw, which is much better. Come on. Thank you. And this bomb attack should kill them. Dang. Time's almost up. Alright. Fight these mummies. <coughs> Come on. Mm. If we can beat the claw. That's okay. I was gonna say, come on, you. Mm. Fight. I want to see what's in this area. I think it's mm. the claw. It better be the claw or I'm going to be pissed. Yep. Well, then again, it could be a spell. Better be the claw, though, because I thought, because I said it was the claw. Mm. But if it's life, I'll be happy. Yay, Charm Claw! We just got a sucky weapon. Woohoo! But it's actually a better version of the claw. <sighs> Nine and a half minutes. How the time flows. Well, we're going to go down this way. Oh, right into a battle. Perfect. Isn't that wonderful? Yeah. Right into a battle. Well, luckily for us, the battle is over. Well, that was this segment. Next segment, I continue in the mines. This is Genova Member signing off.